when I was checking yes. out your IMDb, I see that you're not an overnight sensation. You've been at this since no. 2007. Um, that's that's a long haul. <laughs> um, a that's long a long haul. That's a long haul, baby. But you know what? It takes yeah. 10 years to become an overnight success, traditionally, Say it right? Again. <laughs> it's like someone good. saying it's like oh yeah look at him he just came out of nowhere well no sweetie i've been toiling yeah. away at this for you know 10 plus years um yeah, for yeah, you yeah. was there ever a point in the in the journey where you felt kind of disheartened like wow maybe i need to go and pursue something else because you know i find that with most creatives um, it's not just you guys are not just firing on one cylinder. Traditionally, mm -hmm. if you're an actor, you're probably a singer, you're probably a writer, mm -hmm. you're probably a director. You know, there's a myriad of things that are in your spirit. Creativity is is mm -hmm. boundless. So was there ever a point in this acting journey that you said, mm, maybe I should look at something else? I think most definitely. I think that's like that's a part of that's a part of the beginning process, you know, and I'm and, and I would always tell people like I speak on this a lot when I speak in like with friend groups or if I get an opportunity to speak to young, young, aspiring artists, I'm always like, you know, faith is a big thing, you know, and I don't mm -hmm. care really what your spiritual compass is or what you ground yourself in, but grounding yourself in something that you have faith in is important because if you feel like your faith is giving you a purpose, then you'll keep going. Right. And that's something that for me was always big is I felt like at many times when I got down or when I was like, you know, on that hundredth audition and it wasn't working out. And, and, and I never really was the person to, to, to look to my right or to my left. I always focused on my grass, but at the end of the day, mm -hmm. if I wasn't progressing as quickly as I thought, then my faith could wane. But I always reminded myself, if I double down on my faith, because I believe this is my purpose, then I'm going to keep going. So even in my dark days, I kept saying like, well, you know what, as soon as I get to a point where I want to give up, let me just give one more. And then if that one doesn't turn into something, then let me question where I'm supposed to go. But it always turned out that that moment that I said, ah, enough is enough. And I said, well, I'm just going to go in this audition and play and have fun. That would be the one I booked. And I'm like, okay, that's the sign to keep going. You know? So I always yeah. felt like, my faith and my purpose were aligned. Um, and, and, and I followed that. I followed that. So it kept me. And I was just like, you know, at the end of the day, if it did, I had an age in mind. If it didn't work out, if it didn't work out by that age, then I definitely would have probably done something else. 